here on Guiding Star Marina in Plymouth. Here on the bows, looking at the foredeck. Bow sprit brought back in while uh, on her berth in the marina. Nice view around the deck here. So a traditional working boat converted to a yacht. Varnished teak uh, coach roof. Here's the varnished teak fore hatch and the uh, manual windlass. It's been rebuilt. Gaff main with a new loose footed slab reefing mainsail. All new rigging about five years ago. With uh, galvanised rigging traditionally uh, parcelled and served with dead eyes and lanyards. Varnished teak skylight. And life raft, and here's the uh, flue for the reflex diesel heater. This is the new topsail stowed on its pole on the uh, on the bulwarks out of the way. So, lug rig mizzen. Transom hung rudder. Is the uh, traditional binnacle and the controls for the Volvo engine. Access to the lazarette, good storage. Here we have bronze high field levers for the running back stays for the main. Which are split at the top to support the main mast in at the top of the head of the mast and at the hounds. Access to the engine room. The Volvo D240. And the entrance hatch going down below. Here we are down below on Guiding Star. Entrance hatch, 
into the aft living area. To starboard is a small double berth. Good length. Gimbaled lamps. Switch panel in behind the companion steps. And the galley to port. Twin stainless sinks with manually pumped water. Hardwood worktops and a Taylor's paraffin stove with oven. Moving forward into the main cabin. Fantastic headroom here under the coach roof. To port we have the chart desk with navigation instruments, VHF, AIS, AIS. Port side, city berth. Saloon table with a leaf that folds up either side. Starboard to tea berth, storage locker, and a reflex diesel heater recently fitted. Looking aft here to the companion steps. Now the varnished teak skylight above. Moving forward, the duck under the main beam into the fore peak. The rope locker and storage here to port. Heads compartment to starboard. The Blake's manual lavac and a hand basin. Forward berth, a double V. Storage space under and the anchor chain there. And another locker here outboard. And above steps up to the fore hatch. The traditionally laid deck, solid deck. Large knees here. And the structure of the boat is all open. Good ventilation. And uh, you can see exactly what's going on with her for maintenance. Moving back aft into the main saloon. Wonderful space this, especially of an evening with the oil lamp going. Full of character. Aft again and then up the companion steps on deck. 